So here we are. We are in uh, Ocean Shores, Washington still, and drove past a little place and I saw a sign. They had a bunch of little mopeds out here and you could rent a moped for basically $40 an hour. And you can take it on the beach, you know, go around town, whatever you want to do. I said, oh, that'd be kind of cool to rent a moped and take it on the beach, get some uh, GoPro footage of going to the beach with a moped. And, uh, you know, some of you who personally know me know that I used to ride a motorcycle for quite a few years. And uh, so I'm thinking, okay, cool. Moped, that'd be easier than riding a motorcycle. So I'm, let's check out uh, some of these mopeds and see if I can uh, get one rented. So I selected a black moped and after everything plus tip, the total came up to $50 for this little visit. Uh, typically $40 for the first hour, $25 for any additional hour, I believe. So with renting a moped, first thing they do is go over how to operate the moped. The moped is going to be an automatic transmission. Your front brake is still going to be the right brake handle. Your rear brake is going to be the left brake handle. So you're not using your feet for uh, braking and shifting. Um, the bike or the moped is actually a pretty neat little ride. It's only about like 50 cc's for the engine. It can't go very fast. Um, you know, the signals operate just like on a motorcycle. You have to use your mirrors and keep your head on a swivel and you uh, are suggested to ride with the high beams on to make yourself more visible. While driving on the sand, you're going to only want to use your rear brake in case you have to stop. You're going to run into some soft sand, and if you're going to use your front brake, you're going to end up laying down the moped. So use the rear brake try to stay on hard pack sand without going into any water the moped is not uh, doesn't have a high enough engine to be able to uh, cruise very fast so you're going to be going pretty slow other than that the moped is really easy to operate you probably will end up laying the moped down once once you hit some soft sand or end up using the front brake on accident I did hit a little patch of soft sand and end up laying down the moped once no big deal they just want you to take it easy and not go through uh, any water of any kind and um, try not to wreck their moped so with that being said, let's get out and check out the beach with the moped. I wish I remembered my sunglasses. The soft sand is not very good to ride on.
Justin! <laughs> I think you need a flag on the back of it. So we're back, we just went out on the beach. Uh, we went by affordable mopeds, we rented a moped. Uh, you know, only $40 an hour to rent a moped, not too bad at all. They treated it like a, a car rental, it was really great. We were able to go out on the beach, we were able to get some shots of going up and down the beach a little bit. And back safe, these things are really easy to operate. Really easy to operate. I do understand that I have some experience with motorcycles, so I had a little bit of an advantage, but other than that, easy to operate. Definitely come on down to Affordable Mopeds. I'll put their uh, contact information in the description below so you guys can check them out. Thanks. See you guys in the next one.